Here I have a 2012 Specialized Roubaix Elite uh, bike, road bike. It's a uh, nice bike and uh, I bought it but it didn't come with a headset. <laughs> so kind of complicated, especially this bike for some reason. It has a very rare bottom headset uh, bearing size. So in here, it sits up pretty high. And the fork's pretty specific. It has a, a raised crown race uh, that is an integrated crown race, I believe, also, because it's kind of into the carbon steerer there. Um, so it took me a while to find this bottom bearing. It is, the one I got is a Cane Creek 40. Uh, no markings on it from what I can see. It does fit. I have test fitted already. Uh, I'm pretty sure the uh, inner angle of the uh, inner bearing uh, race, I guess you could say. I'm pretty sure it's a 36 millimeter, there, or 36 degree. There is 45 degree available. I don't, I, I can't really measure the, the race angle. I don't have a tool to do that, so it was kind of a guess. Um, but it seems to fit well, and I've been told that this does fit these Roubaix uh, frames. So, uh, outer diameter is 49 millimeter. And then I'm going to measure in here. 49 millimeter, so that's correct. Um, the inner um, dimension... Uh, this is a tapered steer tube from one and one eighth to one and three eighths, and that's why it is so impossible to find this bearing because no one makes them. Uh, I'll get you the uh, model number of this bearing so you can search it. It is a Cane Creek HD 1446K. I got it on eBay. It was one of the only places I could find it. It was uh, $22.50 US. So that took care of that. Now it just fits in there. I'm going to grease it nice and good. And then uh, I also needed the top. So I bought a normal, I think it's campy style, the 45 by 45 degree. Gonna double check it once I pull it out. Again, it's a Cane Creek 40. I wanted to match up the headset. Um, so on top here it says forty international standard, 41 to 42. So it's, uh, I think it's a 42 millimeter, uh, Diameter here, diameter of the head tube, inner diameter, and take this apart. Okay, yeah, it has a on the side of the bearing 40 series, 41.8 millimeter. So that's 42 millimeter, and it fits right in like that. Now that I look at this, um, I don't really agree with this cap. Doesn't cover the uh, reamed part of the uh, head tube. I may use a different cap or put a spacer in there or something. But I'll decide that later. Anyways, I'll uh, get it all together and I'll show you how it works. Right. 